see. There it goes. Look at that. Hey, so this is a follow-up video of my previous video about that Lenovo laptop with that strange issue that I had challenged anybody to help diagnose and see if they can get it correct. A little fun little game I thought I'd try. Hey, uh, before you, if you haven't seen my previous video before you watch this one, maybe go back and watch the one before. That previous video was named Computer Repair Solution Tips and Tricks. And while I showed in that video some pretty uh, dusty and nasty computers, I had a little bonus at the end that showed a Lenovo laptop with a strange uh, issue, a strange noise. Uh, and I've asked my, my viewers to see if they could figure out uh, what they thought it was. And I've had a lot of great responses. And I really appreciate everybody who put down in the comments what they thought the issue might be. And uh, guess what? Some were right or pretty darn close. Some were wrong. But they all were good guesses, uh, educated guesses, I would say. Anyway, just real quick, I'm Tim with Tim'sComputerFix.net. I own a computer repair shop in the Savannah, Georgia area. If you're ever in my area and need any help with repairing your computer, please look me up. I can help you out. So, the solution. I've we're all like itching to know who was right, who got it right, what's the solution to this problem? Well, I'm about to show you. And to be honest, my, I, I myself never saw this issue before. My, uh, my other technician certainly hadn't ever seen it. It was a bit surprising to us. Um, but, um, but you guys, some of you guys guessed it, and, and I was really impressed with that. But let me just say also that the ones that did it, that got it, I would say, correct, were really close. Uh, the repair to it, nobody got, okay, how to fix this issue. I, th I think that was a little tricky. It's kind of a, a little trick repair. But uh, anyways, you know, I've had a lot of fun with this, and uh, it, it's kind of making me want to do some more. See if I can come up with some, some not-so-common repairs in my shop to maybe I can put up and maybe let you guys take a gander or a guess at what it may be. I don't know, just something a little, little, a little added bonus to my videos. You know, I might do this every now and then, so, so we'll see how that goes. So with that being said, everyone, let's go ahead and take a look at what the issue was with this Lenovo laptop and what we did to repair it. Is that the speakers? Is there Maybe. a mute? Is it the speakers? Mute the speakers. Uh, try it now. It is the speakers! Ah, oh, that's right. The speakers is where that noise was coming from on this laptop. Congratulations, everyone who who guessed correctly that it was indeed the speakers where the sound was coming from. You got that part right. However, nobody guessed correctly why we were getting this. It almost sounds like feedback, and I guess you could call it feedback. But uh, I'm going to show you here exactly now what we did to correct this issue. It wasn't a microphone problem. You see... I had originally thought that maybe there was a blown or bad capacitor that was whistling. That's kind of the direction I was going in, but um, turned out that wasn't the case. But if you see here under the keyboard, you can see that CMOS battery, that yellow CMOS battery. So I'm going to zoom into that a little bit. And once we zoom in there, you're going to notice this yellow and green wire that kind of floats in underneath the CMOS battery. We'll highlight it here in red. This, this yellow and green wire runs underneath the CMOS battery and uh, it runs up to, well, see if you can guess where that runs to. Of course, I think we've already said it. It runs to our speaker. So here on the other side of the keyboard, I'll try to show you, get you 
get you a little bit better view here. This uh, green and yellow wire runs directly to the, the speaker, which is shown here. It's flipped upside down, so there's our speaker here. So turns out that uh, somebody had been in this laptop before and routed that wire underneath that CMOS battery. We rerouted that wire to this area shown here in red, and that completely stopped the issue. So something about that wire being underneath that battery was causing issues with the feedback on the, on the speakers for whatever reason. The microphone was just fine. So hey, let's move on to some shout outs, some congratulations to some of the YouTube viewers here that got, uh, you know, for the most part, got the diagnosis right. Hey, Terry, that's Wilbur Bear, that's WTBM123 is his YouTube channel. Uh, congratulations. Uh, you, you had a lot of guesses uh, di well, what you thought it might be, but you did mention the word speaker, so I think that gets you into my congratulation list. Next we have YouTube viewer Johnny Ringo. Johnny, <laughs> yeah, you pretty much nailed it. You were adamant about, about it. I was pretty impressed with... Um, with how you just called that right out for the most part you had it right uh exact feedback audio loop was one of your exact phrases in your in your comments uh but unfortunately the uh the cause of it was not was not correct it had nothing to do with the mic but congratulations there johnny okay forgive me if i get this wrong or pronounce it wrong my next youtube viewer nasim razik Congratulations. In your comments, you did mention speaker feedback. So uh, that, was a, that was a good guess there. You were correct in that. Um, unfortunately, we didn't have to replace the speakers, but you, know, you, you did guess the correct location where this noise was coming from. So congratulations. Again, forgive me if I pronounced this wrong. Another YouTube viewer, Mike Nagoya. Congratulations. You also... Uh, mentioned mic feedback in your comment so that's enough to get you on my congratulations list good job there buddy okay and this is a little borderline but okay simon zarafa another youtube viewer who is uh who i've known for for a number of years simon zarafa okay he did mention the word cmos battery in his comment so i i think that's Close enough to give you some congratulations there. So thanks a lot, Simon. So I just really want to thank all of my YouTube viewers and thanks for all the comments and thanks for watching my videos. Hey, that's going to wrap it up for this video. Thanks for all the comments and the feedback. Tim'sComputerFix.net is where you can find me. So until next time, everyone, see you soon.